Hey everyone, Sula here from MistyHilltops.com. Thanks for stopping by. In this episode, I am working on a 4x6 traveler's notebook layout that I titled Saturday Lunch and it is for my school days uh, traveler's notebook. I'm using the paper pack back to school from Panalisa, which is just a paper pack and the rest of it, I just, all the embellishments I created myself. So here I'm starting with layering the papers that I'm gonna use. I already cut them and I ran as usual my card around the edges so that the edges will pop up off the page and it just gives a more a deeper look to my page a fuller look and um, yeah the the um, patterned papers they uh, pop off the page a lot better um, I start obviously with layering with the last um, paper or the bottom paper that goes first on the page and so um, I do like to arrange everything on the page not so much with the embellishments but with the papers to make sure that I um, glue things in the right place there is only so much that my glue will forgive me with mistakes and so I try not to um, just randomly start to glue something on and then I realize I run out of space or something so I like to arrange everything and then I will start gluing um, as far as the papers go. So here I'm, I'm slowly working my way up the, the various layers there. Uh, then I have this um, kind of plaid pattern paper that will go. And um, obviously I have to, not obviously, but I will have to actually tuck uh, another piece of embellishment that I want to go behind it, this one. I created this with a stamp that I then fussy cut. I stamped it on uh, one of my cardstock papers there and then I um, cut around it. And so it is a nice little um, extra to this page. It's a food or restaurant themed uh, page. And so I wanted to have some food or restaurant themed um, um, embellishments to go with this page. For the um, small square picture there, I used one of my label dies and then I um, used that as a photo mat. And then I have this um, strip of washi tape. I felt it worked well with that other red floral pattern paper, which actually doesn't come from the a paper pack but it comes uh, I just had it in my stash with a different paper pack but I thought it really worked well with the colors of this paper pad and so I added that one to this page here um, so now I can start adding the little photos they are probably around the size of 1.5 by 2 inches and um, so I'm adding those to this page um, and there will be two on the one side and um, one on the other side and then I had these little um, uh, dies to um, cut out these uh, the, the fork and knife so I did that and now this can be added to my page there and um, uh, I probably watercolored these uh, the, the the silverware there and then um, I uh, think this is a cork piece that I'm adding um, as a little more uh, extra embellishment then I can go to the other side and add the photo there um, the title I already stamped the word Satur Saturday and then lunch and so um, this can go on there and that will be my title and now I can add a few more embellishments there either uh, uh, stamped with uh, probably some um, some dies and then uh, I have all these little flowers that I die cut and um, shaped a little bit so I'm adding these to the page as well and um, that leaves me with pretty much uh, most of it done there's this one more label that I need to add um, this tag uh, looking label there which I also stamped on and um, that will be my page done I'm going to leave you with some more close-ups I hope you enjoyed this video um, consider giving it a thumbs up if you did consider subscribing and I hope you have a great day thanks for watching bye